welcome everyone <laughs> let's talk guys let's talk let's talk about your person's feelings okay let's talk about how they view you and their feelings now this is going to be something different on the channel so i'm going to uh, show you guys how it's going to be done all right so on this side this is going to be your feelings okay and on this side this is going to be how they view you and their feelings okay it's going to be a quick read it is going to be a collective read so it may or may not resonate okay if it does not resonate guys check out your um, other videos all of the signs should be posted i think i only have one more video to do I'm not sure which sign it is i think it's i want to say i'm not sure i'm going to say libra but um majority of the signs all the rest of the signs are up for september okay so this is going to be a collective reading all right um if you would like to book a personal reading, guys, that information is in the drop box below. If you want to order the money magnet oil, all right? If you want to order the money magnet oil, comment um, your email address below, and I'll invoice you for um, the money magnet oil. Um, if you are new to the channel, welcome, guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We would love to have you here. Go ahead and click the bell to subscribe. Everything that you guys need is going to be in the description box below, okay? So, are y'all ready? Let's do it. Let's talk. Let's talk. Let's talk. Let's see. All right. Let's see what we got here. Like I said, guys, the on the left side, this is going to be how you view this person, how you feel about this person. And on the right side, it's going to be how they feel. Okay, so we're going to talk about your feelings first. All right, so how does my collective view their person? <laughs> All right, so we have heart-to-heart -heart conversation. All right, so we have heart-to-heart -heart conversation. So you could have had a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with this person or you want to, Okay. You want to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with this person. You feel like it's about time, especially with engagement here in chemistry. I feel like you've been some of, <clears throat> some of you guys have been separated from this person. We got separation here, so there's been a separation period, um, and but the chemistry is still there. There's a strong magnetic chemistry here, um, and I feel like you are you feel like this is something that's needed to take you guys is. Uh, relationship to the next level but i do feel like there possibly has been like a separation period okay so how does this person view um my viewer how does this person view my viewers We have healing family issues, okay? So they could be trying to heal, okay? They may feel, yeah, we got retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. I feel like they feel very disconnected from you. Um, like I said, I do feel like some of you guys have been like on a separation period from this person. We got retreat, then we got engagement and chemistry. So I feel like the same way that you feel about this person, they feel about you too. Like the chemistry between you guys is there. Um, and there's possibly is a heart to heart conversation that has already happened or is getting ready to happen after a period of like, kind of like being away from each other. Okay. Because I got retreat here. It's time to disconnect from the world. They may want to just spend quality time with you um, to try to heal this. But let's go into the tarot and let's see what's going on. So we're going to talk about uh, you first. Okay. We're going to talk, see what, what your side has to say. And then we'll go into theirs. Okay. <clears throat> all right so how does <clears throat> i need to get a glass of water or something here we go because oh somebody might be thirsty thirsty to talk to somebody or thirsty because i'm so thirsty right now like 
I, I ran and got this PG so fast. Like, okay, so, all right. So, how does my uh, <clears throat> how does my viewer view their person? Like, show me how they view their person. We got the nine of cups. Ooh, okay. We got the three of swords and the ace of wands. All right, so at the bottom of the deck. Ooh, ooh. Okay, so I'm I'm getting here. At the bottom of the deck, we got the emperor, the empress, and the six of wands. So this could most definitely be like your soulmate or your twin flame because it doesn't get any better than the emperor and the empress okay this could definitely be a uh, soulmate energy and or um twin flame energy but this could also be like a baby mother and a baby father situation but somebody is trying to get you feel like this person is trying to get your attention you do feel like this person is trying to get your attention um you do feel like with the nine of cups here that they have a wish fulfillment, okay? They do want to have this heart-to-heart -heart conversation. You're like, oh, you want to talk to me now, okay? After you broke my heart with the Three of Swords or played me or cheated on me, put me in a third-party situation. Um, and But uh, you do feel like this person wants a new start, a new beginning, okay? With the Ace of Wands, it's definitely sexual energy as well, too, all right? I'm even seeing like somebody wants to have a threesome. I'm seeing that as well, too. But let's see. Um, I do want to see why the why the Ace of Wands is here. Because this is a new beginning. Okay, we got the Nine of Swords. Somebody, some, you're, you're a person. Um, well, you could be starting to worry, okay? I'm getting, like, anxiously waiting. Somebody here is anxiously waiting on somebody to express their feelings with the Ace of Cups. So you possibly have been waiting for this person, anxiously for this person to express how they feel. Because um, they possibly had you in a third-party situation or they just hurt you and tore, you know, messed up the bond and connection. All right? Yeah, see, somebody's expressing their feelings of the past with the Ace of Cups and the Six of Cups. Definitely. Like, somebody uh is wanting to express themselves so you feel like your your person wants to talk about the past okay knight of wands how much that they were playing around and doing them knight of wands is very much so player energy okay telling people that they're single they could have been playing around telling people that they're single with the eight of wands and the nine of pentacles um and you felt you didn't find that cool. Like you didn't find that fun. You didn't find that to be funny. You didn't find anything. You didn't find that funny. Okay. Like they were around here doing all this playing. You didn't find this funny. So now they want to talk. <clears throat> now they want to talk. And I feel like you want to hear it. You've been waiting to hear this anyway. <laughs> You've been waiting to hear this the whole time anyway. You've been waiting on it. So let's see how they're how they how they're viewing it. Because we got healing family issues. Now it looks like they want to heal. They want to fix things. You know, they want to make things right. So show me. Yeah, the judgment card wanted to jump out. Definitely. They want a second chance. They do want to um they do want a second chance, like a do-over. And they want a final decision to be made. Like, let's see. Show me how they view. Ooh, how they view uh my viewer. How are they viewing the situation? Okay, we got the eight of pentacles. So they're putting in effort. Okay, they're putting in the effort um after a long period like they this person moves really really slow like the knight of pentacles energy 
This is very much so Capricorn's energy, but they move extremely slow. Like they, it took them a long time to say this or come to you um, and express their feelings. Like they really, really drug their feet. Like really, really slow. Really, really slow. All right, we got the strength core. You could be dealing with the Leo. Oh, yeah, they were afraid. They were dragging their feet because they're scared. With the Eight of Swords and the strength core, like, they feel possibly feel like you have a really strong mind. And I feel like uh, this intimidates them, okay? Because we got the Four of Wands and the Nine of Pentacles. So somebody is want stability and long term but somebody here they feel like you you possibly have done this by yourself okay you built this home you built um like you gained stability by yourself like you're doing good like they see you doing good they see you doing good four of wands and the nine of pentacles definitely like you're doing good okay and they know that you're very strong-minded they know that and i feel like that intimidates them so that's why it's taking them so long to put in the effort but i do feel like this person uh does want to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you and they um do want to like heal okay they want to heal the things that they've broken um the bond that they've broken the hearts that they've broken like they want to they want to kind of heal all right so give me they want to heal this situation all right, yeah, see, with the Ten of Swords, yeah, see, the Ten of Swords, <laughs> this person may have stabbed you in the back, betrayed you, um, and they feel bad about it, I feel, um, but this is what the Ten of Swords and the Seven of Swords came out together, like, they're done telling lies, okay, see, we got the Page of Wands and the Three of Cups, they might have been telling their friends lies, um, Look, look at this. The Justice and the Five of Wands. They want to fix this. Like, they want to balance this out. They want to just, you know, kind of like be on good terms. They want to be back on good terms with you. Okay? I feel like they they lied. They cheated. They did what they did. And now they want to fix it. Okay? <laughs> yeah. And they have a lot of people watching them. Um, with the Six of Wands, they could be definitely spying on you. Or they see that you've been getting a lot of attention. Um, with the Six of Wands and the Page of Swords, King of Pentacles could most definitely be a, a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, King of Wands, um, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. <clears throat> but here we go, like with this Judgment card. Like, yeah, they want a second chance. They know that you're guarded and they see other, other men or other females. I'm getting men. I'm getting two men here, King of Pentacles and a King of Wands. Um, but they're definitely spying on you and watching you. They see that you're getting attention from other people. With the Three of Cups and the, and the Page of Wands, yeah. You've been, they, they're watching you communicate and talk to other people. So now they're at the point where they're like, oh, no, what do, what do they think they're going? What do they think they're doing? Because we're going to fix this. We're going to work this out. We're going to fix this. The Justice and the Five of Wands. Let's try to get a resolution. Come to a resolution. We need a resolution. We need a resolution. How does song go by Leah? Yeah, that's how they're feeling right now. <laughs> that's how they're feeling right now. I do want to see why the Seven of Swords is here, though. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Yeah, we got the Ten of Cups and the Six of Pentacles. Somebody cheated. I'm getting like there's somebody lied or cheated. Um, said Lied and said that they weren't in a relationship or something to that nature. Um... We got the Four of Pentacles and the Sun. Could be dealing with the Leo. Four of Pentacles is keeping, you know, holding back. They've been holding, they've been holding back, holding, um, they just been kind of like holding this in, like what they want to say to you because they feel like it was a big risk, okay? But now they want to move forward, okay? Now they want to move forward. I got the Empress and the Queen of Cups here. Could be dealing with the Libra or Taurus or Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I'm getting that they were juggling two people here, two or more people here with the Two of Pentacles and the Empress and the Queen of Cups, okay? So juggling two people here, and I'm getting like now they want to talk, okay, um, with the King of Cups and the Page of Cups and Knight of Cups. Now they want to talk about how they feel. Um, and I do feel like somebody was juggling two people here, okay? I'm getting somebody felt disrespected, 
Uh, I'm getting don't disrespect me with the death and the seven of wands and the king of swords, okay? Somebody felt disrespected, okay? And this is about something that happened in the past with the ace of cups and the six of cups. So this is somebody's feelings. They're still somebody could they're still holding a grudge from the past. If something happened in the past before they're holding a grudge, and this is why they're behaving this way. Now they want to try to heal and fix stuff after they done messed everything up. Okay, so let's see. Um, let's see what the angels have to say. Oh, I know it. Let me give me a second. Let me see. I'm going to. Uh, I know what deck I want to use. Sorry, guys. All right, so let's see what they want to say, okay? <clears throat> All right, so what do they want to say to my viewer? What do they want to say to my viewers? What do they want to say that they aren't saying <clears throat> or they haven't said? What do they want to say? Ooh. All right. They're stubborn as heck. I can't even get the cards to... <laughs> they are holding it in. They do not want to... There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. All right. So... We got, I'm at a crossroads. I'm choosing which path to take. Like I said, I feel like they were juggling, okay? And they need to make up their mind. And they feel insecure, okay? They feel insecure. They're not sure of themselves. And I have seen the future with you. I want you by my side. So they do want you. They do want to fix this. They do want to fix this. And they do want to be with you um but i feel like they are at a crossroad like they're trying to figure out how to approach you how to come towards you because they've already hurt you before so they don't know how to really come at you okay they aren't really sure give me give me three more messages please spirit say all right you're being greedy <laughs> okay so I got, um, I'm in a dark place. Spirit is sending me light. So they're in a really dark place in their life right now. I don't feel like they're in a good place to even really kind of, this is something that I feel like this is what they want, but they're in a dark place right now. They aren't really there. They want a second chance, but are they ready? Okay. And they have a lot of sexual thoughts about you. They think about you sexually a lot and they want to meet up with you. Yeah. They want to get together and meet up with you and link up with you and do the bump, bump, dippity, bump, bump. <laughs> they want to do all of that. They want to do all of that with you. They want to link up. Um, but just let's make sure that this is not just a sexual connection. And if it is, make sure that you move accordingly. Okay. All right, so let me see what messages the angels have to say, and I'm going to let y'all go. All right, so please give me a message for my collective. Give me advice. Ooh, I mean, that came right out. Okay, so you guys are going to have to meditate. If this is your story, you're going to have to meditate so you can get the answers that you seek, okay? And also communicate clearly exactly what it is that you want so it comes to you now. But, yeah, see, <laughs> Spirit wants you to ask your angels. Okay, so ask for a sign on what direction to take, okay? But we got yes, okay? And then we got... Um, abundance, okay? And look, we got reconsider here at the bottom of the deck, okay? 
All right, so let me, I want to grab a clarifier for all of these because I want to see what is what. Okay, so we have um, Ask Your Angels. Woo, like these cards jumping. King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Some of you are definitely dealing with the Earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. See, look at this. We got the Empress and the Chariot and the Fool. Okay, so um, you could be dealing with an Earth sign female or male. Okay, but the Empress is actually mother energy as well, too. Uh, on very, very feminine energy. Okay, the angels want you to ask for a sign before you move forward. Okay, like I said, someone this could be a side piece or somebody, um, somebody's mother or aunt, but somebody is they feel like they want to move forward, but they feel like something is a risk. Okay, so they're holding back, they're holding back, but they want to definitely move, come towards you, but. Uh, Spirit is saying, you know, and look for the signs. Okay, why is the King of Pentacles here? Yeah, Four of Cups. Four of Cups. Why is the Four of Cups here? Yeah, Spirit is saying, don't give this person all of your attention with the Six of Wands. Make sure that you're spreading this out. Like with the Temperance, make sure you're having a balance. Don't overindulge in this person because I feel like this person just isn't like they haven't fully completely made up their mind. They're they're still like they move slow. Let's let's remember that previously their energy was very slow paced energy. Okay, so I feel like spirit is saying, and this is the Temperance card is Sagittarius energy, and the Hierophant is Taurus's energy, but I'm getting like an open book. Um, there may be just wait for this person to open up a little bit more. Don't give this person all of your attention. Don't give this person all of your attention because, like I said, see, we got the nine of wands and the king of wands. This is like be cautious because this person could definitely be like be real fine as fuck and they use that as you know a way to manipulate and be tricky. All right. <clears throat> Okay, so we got yes. So let's see why yes is here. Yeah, see, seven of cups. This person could most definitely see you're gonna find out the truth about this person that this person is juggling. See, we got the two of pentacles and the ace of swords. So you're definitely going to find out the truth of that this person is either juggling or this person hasn't completely made up their mind. Okay, so <clears throat> be on the lookout too. With the Five of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles, this person could most definitely be in a messed up situation financially. They could be like, you know, trying to find somebody to fall back on and lean back on. With the Five of Pentacles here, this is saying that they could be in a, you know, like a, a financial burden or um, just in a place where it's not as bright, okay? See, there's stuff that, see, there's something that they that they aren't telling you. Okay, with the Death card and the Knight of Cups. They aren't telling you how. They aren't telling you everything with the Page of Cups and the King of Cups. They aren't telling you everything. Okay. So, there's more information that you need to find out about this person. You need to find out if they are juggling, for one. And you need to get them to communicate clearly. Okay, ask the right questions. Because somebody most definitely um, <clears throat> either has options or... Or they have a lot going on on their plate. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Yeah, they got options. The Seven of Cups and the Empress. Yeah, they got options. And they're running through them like, like water. Knight of Swords and the Hermit. Yeah. Knight of Swords and the Hermit. They're definitely running through their options. Um, like I said, like water. This person definitely has options. Okay, they got options. And like I said, you need to make sure that their intentions are good okay i mean i feel like for a lot of you they are in a bad situation and they're trying to keep their options open all right so we got abundance okay we got the eight of cups i'm sorry the eight of pentacles and the eight of swords the number eight is very significant here but somebody is trying to scare somebody or make somebody trying to make somebody think something <clears throat> Why is the Eight of Swords here? 
Oh, they're trying to make you feel think that they've changed. They're trying to get you to think that they've changed, okay? But like I said, <clears throat> you got to ask the right questions with this person, okay? Because like I said, the Queen of Pentacles and the Five Pentacles, like the same cards are coming out. You're going to have to make sure that you're asking the right, the right questions because this person is trying to make you think that they have changed. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? Page of Pentacles. Yes, talking nice. Um, with the Page of Pentacles and the Temperance. That's them talking nice and sweet and telling you what they feel like you want to hear. Okay? Like I said, you got to be careful. You got to be careful with their intentions. Okay? Yeah, telling you what you want to hear with the Page of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups and the Eight of Wands. And then when, then when they feel like they got you comfortable, they ask for things. The Eight of Wands and the Ace of Pentacles. And they run off with the Knight of Wands, okay? And this could leave you feeling regretful, like regretting it later, okay? So they they are at a place, yeah, they feel like you are, you, you're set. They feel like you're set with the Queen of Cups, the Emperor, the Ten of Pentacles, and the Four of Wands. And the Nine of Pentacles. For some of you, this is a marriage. Like somebody you're married to or you live with this person. But they feel like you're set. So they come over here to tell you what you want to hear. And then they ask for, with the Eight of Wands and the Ace of Pentacles, they may ask for money. They may ask for a gift. They may ask for something. But with the Knight of Wands, they're in and they're out. And they're going to regret it later with the Five of Cups and the Two of Wands. They're going to end up regretting it later. Okay, so... Spirit straight up snitched on this person. And <laughs> I feel like, you know, if this is your situation, double check their intentions. Okay? Double check because this person is like, they just giving me slimy vibes. All right? So, I hope this reading was helpful, guys. And I will chat with y'all later. Make sure to check the description box for extra details. All right? Ciao.